Now, uh, let's go to Skype and uh, Edina Boy, local guy gone good, the cakiest of all the cake eaters in broadcasting, <laughs> Bill Dahlman, VP of News at the new Fox Sports One. Hey, Bill. Hey, how you doing, guys? You got the one now. Let's talk. Let's let's give a little background on Bill. Okay. From Edina, from here, also ran Fox Nine for what? Ten years. I was uh, VP News for seven years. Seven years, and a big reason why this show was on the air. Yeah. So I, I really don't expect high, uh, you know, big accomplishments for this Fox Sports, Fox Sports One here. <laughs> well, what I want to know is when are you and Dan and Seth coming to visit? Uh, you know what? Actually, you know what? I, I was get, meant to call you. I'm coming end of September. You need to pull out that okay. big Fox travel expense report there and uh, put a couple extra names on it. Right. Now, Bill. We've got, got a whole studio lot with four restaurants and, and uh, all kinds of stuff. So uh, there will be plenty of places for you to come and visit. Bill, before we start talking about Fox Sports 1 and how great this is going to be on Saturday, why are we talking to you? You couldn't get us Regis? Where's Regis? Regis is, he's in New York, and he refused to fly out here to talk to you on Skype. I don't know why. I tried. I tried. Okay, and you're best friends with Andy Roddick now. Where's Andy Roddick or Donovan McNabb? Literally every single night, I go and have, you know, I go down to what we call the avocado room. Okay. And have dinner with Donovan and Andy Roddick and Gary Payton and Ephraim Salam. And uh, if I'm lucky, Carissa Thomas comes in, but not very often. So, Bill, tell us what uh, is going to set Fox Sports 1 apart from your obvious competitors, the, uh, the big names in sports TV right now. Well, I think, you know, there's a, the, the Alphabet Network is, is great at what they do and um, very serious. And I think we see a space for, you know, much like Fox 9 with personalities, information, and fun. I mean, it's going to be a program. It's going to be a show instead of a, you know, a compendium of sporting events, and here's another writer to speculate on whether or not Tim Tebow should start at Tom Brady's meetings <laughs> first. Then he, you know, I mean, instead, we've got actual athletes, and we did a rehearsal last night, and Donovan said, Brady's fine. He's going to play. Are you kidding me? You think he's going to let Tebow take his spot? No chance. You know, and that's the kind of stuff that we're going to bring to it that uh, the other sports networks aren't able to do. You know, Bill, and I, I want to bring someone up, Dan O'Toole and Jay Onright. Tell us about them and their background. Well, they're, they're, they're two guys from Canada, and what's, that's, the, that's the risk. But the great part is they already have a camaraderie and a rapport. And I'm telling you, these guys are just naturally funny. I mean, they don't, uh, it's not scripted funny. It's sort of like, uh, well, it's like Tony and Dan. I mean, it's, it's naturally funny, interesting conversation. And they watch the highlights just like you and I or Seth and I would watch it on the couch. And they are so freaking funny. So does that, does that mean that they hate each other off the air like Tony and I do? <laughs> no, they actually like each other much better than you two. Oh, that, that's <laughs> never going to work out then. All right, Bill, so when does Fox Sports 1 launch? We launch Saturday morning. Uh, Saturday morning, full slate of, uh, of sporting events. Um, like I said, we're up and running now on uh, DirecTV and Dish and all the, all the cable networks. It'll be the largest uh, launch of a sports network in history. You just go to the website, punch in your um, zip code, and it tells you what channel you're on no matter what uh, carrier you have. Well, Bill, uh, it's, it's awesome to see that uh, Los Angeles has really down, uh, you know, downsized the, uh, the wardrobe budget that you, <laughs> used to, uh, that you used to get from Fox. That's yeah, it. well, I, I had to wear the T-shirt to fly the flag here, so that's... Uh, you know, I, I, figured, I figured on your show I could slum it a little bit. All right, uh, Bill Dahlman, Fox Sports 1. Everybody check out the launch happening on Saturday. Thanks, Bill. Hey, thanks, no guys. Good to talk to you.